As we are slowly moving through the phases of the nationwide lockdown, and most staff have returned to schools to prepare for the return of learners, all teachers need to take special care to look after their own well-being. To be able to address learners' emotional concerns when they return, you first need to take care of your own mental health. Here are a few tips to consider in this time. Always stay informed and keep evaluating information to make sure you are empowered with reliable, accurate information and resources. Be aware of local services, support networks and resources for your own well-being as well as for supporting learners. Seek support from your fellow educators and share strategies about what works and what doesn't. And make sure you know the following golden rules off by heart. Keep a distance of at least one and a half meters from each other. Don't shake hands or give hugs. Regular hand washing and sanitizing is important. Practice good hygiene when coughing and sneezing. And always wear your mask. It's normal to feel pressure, uncertainty, anxiety, and even fear about returning to school, learners returning to school, and your responsibility towards those learners who are still at home. Acknowledge your feelings and talk about it. Make peace with the fact that you have no control over the choices made by other people and government. Know your own limits and don't be too hard on yourself. Think about previous challenges you faced in your life and how you managed them. Tap into your own strength and remind yourself that this too shall pass. Think about your sources of strength and support and the people who are working hard to make a difference. Be grateful for the good things in the world. Think positive. Engage in positive self-talk and be introspective. Take breaks from watching, reading or listening to news stories about the pandemic and try to maintain your routines and set realistic weekly and daily goals. Eat healthy and well-balanced meals. Exercise daily and get enough sleep. Find ways to be creative. Spend quality time with your loved ones. Debrief by chatting to colleagues, family members or friends. Be kind to others. Be grateful. Give compliments. Do something you enjoy. Read, listen to music, take a bath, practice a hobby or play games with family. Take deep breaths. Stretch, pray, meditate, listen to online sermons, or even motivational messages. Try to change or adapt your behavior, thoughts and attitude to meet the demands of the new normal. Accept the things you cannot change, have the courage to change what you can, and have the wisdom to know the difference. Should you need help regarding your own psychosocial needs or stress-related responses to trauma, you can contact the WCED service provider for employee health assistance.